we are on the back side of the upside down house wonderworks we are going to go in and check it out so join us look at the detail they got the telephone pole upside down and it's even blinking like still works and also like this house crashed into this building i'm excited let's get it here's this side of it this is wonderworks you got some palm trees and bushes up there the detail in this you could hear it like creaking oh this is what i said i said i wanted detail and here it is mailbox. yeah mailbox up there that's broken pillars oh look over here they even got cracks in that it's got an address oh that's the mailbox right there this is so cool and the lights are flickering they should put the address upside down they should have that would have been cool oh here's wonder works i am so excited to go inside the detail in it is amazing it looks like it's just falling right now i gotta get a picture all right let's go inside look it's got the concrete i'm just so excited oh, it's got all this broken stuff this tells you well my dad's not tall enough to ride anything all right, looks like we're the only people in line, so hopefully this means we can get in. Look at everything's upside down in here. You got a table. This is the stairs. That's so cool. Oh, this is so cool. I wish this was my real house. Oh my God, I'm excited. There's stuff in that basket up there. Got a bookshelf where nothing's falling out of. Says we can enter. Oh, all right, let's go to this inversion tunnel. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! I can't look at my camera. Yeah, this is cool. Now I'm about to turn around and take a picture after this. Uh, I feel like I'm really turning upside down. Uh. All right, it's your go. <laughs> Obviously, my best memory on Route 66 here is telling people to follow my YouTube. So that's what I'm leaving. Got a half model T right here you could take photos in. There you go. Oh, you just walk right in and sit. Look at that. Angry driver. Angry driver. Let's go see if we can do this thing real quick. It says exit only. How do we enter? Like that. What the heck? Hold on, I gotta figure out how we enter. Look at all this stuff to do. Jeez. Alright, let's go figure out how we enter. I found the way to enter you. Oh, I'm pretty sure they got something you can put your pockets in. Yep, you're good on the weight. You're barely good on the height. Oh, this is gonna be probably crazy. I'm excited. Hopefully they let us go on with this guy so we don't have to wait and watch. Well, we gotta wait one turn. I guess it's all right. You won't kill me. They'll show us what we're getting into. Kind of reminds me of the boat at Frontier City, that boat ride. Oh, you got a pedal. Oh. You got a pedal to get it over? Apparently so. Oh, God. So it's going to be a one-man job, huh? <laughs> No wonder it's free, you gotta do all the work. Well, I'm excited, I'm about to make it go flippy, flippy, flippy. I don't know if you'll let me put it on this thing to record, but I'm definitely gonna ask. Do the easy one. Ooh, that, that right there kicked my butt. You got a pedal to make it flip. Ooh. See my dad pull it up. Oh. 
it's definitely a little harder. Oh yeah. It's trying to take big leaps, so this is not as hard. Now that one, you'll be picking your body weight up. Let's see it. And now I'm tired. <laughs> yep, and you're really picking your full body weight. Ready? Yeah. And you're still doing good. I'm trying. Oh. I'm gonna go through here and see what this is about. Oh my god. Oh, you gotta get the metal thing without touching the sides? I guess let's see what this is about. I don't know yet. Let's do carnival. All right, now we're about to throw the balls at these things. I got a That's pretty good. Still? Why is it telling me to throw? Okay, that was my go. This is my dad's. This is Pops. Well, I've probably thrown stuff. <laughs> There you go. Extra shy. Good play clock. You did it. I gotta throw it. Oh no, you go first, I think. What? I think you gotta throw it too. We just got our picture taken from this green screen, so I guess we'll probably see at the end what was put behind it. Oh, my dad's gonna try to challenge it. I think he's overthinking it. What's your score? You got 31, 32. There you go, 38, 9. You got 50. Uh, we are now going up this. What looks like, what is this? Where's Waldo or is this like a Paul Bunyan? No, it's like Paul Bunyan. Huge Paul Bunyan stairs. Got a huge twister machine right here. Play again to beat that score. This right here is reading our heat signature. Look at me waving my hand. Oh, it's saying that we're some hotheads. You are. I'm definitely a hothead. Look at my beard is green. That's kind of cool. Your beard is green. That's cool. Uh, Alright, here we go into the military exhibit. Yeah, it basically takes you on a just enough exposure to enjoy everything. We can do some pull-ups, is right there. This one is little easy. Hey, I got actually back up and running. Should have them all. Which day is it going? Uh, Dr. Fiona. Dad's trying the virtual reality. I'll film what he's seeing. He's gonna see what leadership call right, that he gets. So he's seeing your leadership call, okay? Does it look cool? Yeah. It's inside like a. Oh, well, it's tennis. Tennis. Do you hear people talking to you? I think we still need a little bit of a while here. You know when they're driving, they turn, it's getting kind of dizzy. Like you're really in it? 
He didn't finish it. But he doesn't have to. No, 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 no. Alright, we're about to check out these binary sounds. We're gonna take a seat and be instructed as follows. A location from which a sound originated, unless we had two ears. Through a complex process called binaural fusion, the brain compares information received from each ear, then translates the differences into a single sound coming from a particular location. Let's see what this does. Put your hand up like this. Can you beam? This has no beaming right now. Huh. We'll play with this. Oh, look at that. Let's see if I can, I don't know if I can touch it. I'm gonna touch it. Stop it. Let's see if we can build a mount. Yeah, this is so fun. I'm giving life to animals. Isn't that cool? I need to get one of these for toads. Yeah, and you can touch it. Yeah, and it. Oh. Mom, come here. Got a humongous night right here. Very cool. Check out this energy in motion. Oh, I'm definitely doing one of these. That was fun. Now I shall step on. palm trees and the gaps in between the palm trees and they're turning into a camel with no palm trees. Look at this crazy illusion they got. It like warps as you walk. This is a Lego model of the museum that we are currently in. Are these parrots in the box or are they outside of it? Here we have some unorthodox taxidermy of Dr. Seuss. Remember this turtle? Well, now he's here. There's that fish, and that one, and this guy, and these. What the heck? This is pretty cool. I think if I move this down here, yeah, I can control the earth. I'm pretty sure I can zoom in and whatnot. i figure out how to do it. No, don't go that far, buddy. Oh no, I'm going far away and I don't want to go far away. Oh no. Well, the earth is out of my control now. With this knob, I can control the moon and get right upon it, probably. Yeah. Look, these are places they have already named. 
Dagira, I don't know how to say that. Mar Nectens, I don't know. This angle that you walk up is 20 minutes after the Titanic struck the iceberg. This angle, 60 minutes after the Titanic struck the iceberg. This one right here was 110 minutes. It's like walking straight up a wall. This right here says this is zero degrees water. That if you want to feel what it feels like in the water that was in the Titanic. But I do not, so it doesn't apply. Let's go look at this. They're calling it a hurricane shack. So I'm guessing it's about to get a little crazy. Yeah. Look at that, you got electric love. Oh my gosh, look at that defying the gravity. It's going up. No, but the way it's like the lighting and stuff makes it look like it's floating up. That's the whole it's like a black hole looking thing. My camera looks like it's going up too, kind of. This is a cool little use of an old truck. 